So I got two cans. And this here, this here I just use for a priming pan. I put a little bit of alcohol on here to prime this thing here. This is a pellet tin. You can see I've got my cotton balls in there. And then little holes for the jets and stuff that come up. And then denatured alcohol. Let me just fill it up. I think it's about one fluid ounce maybe. It's not too much. And a little bit in that pan. Pan is what primes it and gets it going. And this is so it burns a little slower. That's why it's got a cap on it with little holes. So it burns a little slower. And then here's the top plate I'm going to use. Just a piece of steel. And then here's the pan. And I put some Pam in here to help the eggs cook better. And then here's the eggs right here. Here we go. It's going to be an invisible flame too. Because it's the sun's out. So you're not going to be able to see the flame. And there it goes. You can, I don't know if you can see the flame or not, but it's it's hot. I let it warm up a little. Before I put my eggs on, I'm gonna let it warm up the bottom of the pan. Okay, I can feel the heat, but I can't see the flames. And just give me a couple minutes here and I'll show you the eggs. They're just starting to form now.
it would actually cook faster probably in a thinner pan. This is a thick pan. I just wanted to test out a thicker pan. And I think it's only one fluid ounce, but it seems to be handling this pan pretty good. And I know it'll boil a few cups of water for like tea or something. I've already had tea out here before with it. Gotta readjust this thing. There you got some scrambled eggs. <laughs> 